SALT ARREST, INCLUDING REACTION FROM STUDENTS AT BAKERSFIELD COLLEGE WHERE HUNDREDS ARE GETTING READY FOR GRADUATION RIGHT NOW. BUT FIRST TONIGHT WE WILL CHECK IN WITH 23 ABC'S IVAN RODRIGUEZ WHO JOINS US NOW WITH THE VERY LATEST ON THE ASSAULT INVESTIGATION. IVAN. Jackie, BPD has confirmed that they've arrested 19-year-old Brandon Robinson. Now authorities at Bakersfield College say they caught him in the act of sexually assaulting a woman in the restroom of the Fine Arts Building. Three separate sexual assault cases in Northeast Bakersfield in just two months. The most recent assault happening yesterday in the woman's restroom of Bakersfield College's Fine Arts Building. It's just, it just gives me an uneasy feeling in there. David Silva goes to BC and spends most of his time in the Fine Arts Building. He also lives in the area of where 19-year-old Brandon Robinson, a standout athlete from Centennial High School, allegedly sexually assaulted another woman back in March. I have two little sisters. I have friends and family that go to BC. I don't like that feeling where you know something like that could happen, especially during the day. BPD says it was during the day when two public safety officers from the college arrived during the election. Alleged assault. An individual saw somebody going into a, a male going into a woman's bathroom, which is definitely kind of out of the ordinary. This student immediately contacted a faculty member who alerted campus officials. And by doing that, they were able to get the, the campus security to that bathroom and ultimately take him into custody and then find out after the fact that well, we believe he's responsible for these other crimes as well. The first sexual assault case was reported on March 2nd on Wenatchee Avenue. A woman approached by a black male from behind when she was sexually assaulted. Police telling 23ABC that victim identified the suspect as Brandon Robinson. And on April 26th, a 15-year-old girl is walking near BC when she was kidnapped and taken into an alley near Haley Street. And yesterday afternoon, a woman who was allegedly assaulted by Robinson inside a women's restroom on campus. BPD saying the proximity of these crimes caught their attention. On all three instances, each description of the suspect was very similar. Age, height, ethnicity, those types of things. Also some physical evidence that was recovered at the scene as well as some of the information that we were able to obtain from victims and witnesses. Baker Bakersfield Police tells 23ABC they have collected DNA evidence in the case, but they said they have not processed the DNA. Robinson making a court appearance today, but in an unrelated trespassing case. He'll be formally arraigned on multiple felony charges connected to the sexual assault cases on Monday. BPD reached out to the victims of these three cases about Robinson's arrest. His bail is currently set at over $700,000. Live in downtown Bakersfield, Ivan Rodriguez, 23ABC News.